Hey guys, welcome back once again to uh, Breath of Fire. When we last left off, I got to the Karma Tower, and we walked around a bit, got a couple of moon tears, or moon drops as they're known in this game, and uh, killed a little time, getting a couple of chests, I apologize about that, but uh, I really wanted to save this fight for when I knew, knew I would have enough time to complete it. I did not get a level, although I did walk around a bit fighting. Actually, what I want to do here... <coughs> excuse me. Blech. I want to cast Fort on Nina, have Soldier 1 use the E key, and then have Soldier 2 attack. Because I think Soldier 2 is a little more physically strong than Soldier 1. But, uh, this guy is not hard. Normally what I would do is I would buff up uh, let's see, Soldier 2's attack power. Maybe Soldier 1's if I got a little extra time and then just uh, go to town with the E key and use on Nina. As you can see, he began crying because apparently Morty is a, someone's little brother. He goes down pretty easily after his second win. Yay, level 7. Come on, learn it. Learn it. Yes, attack up. Alright, now that he's out of the way, what we're going to do now is we're going to go restore our HPZs. And we're going to go up the stairs. And why do you make me fight these useless random battles, game? So, to stop that, I'm actually thinking that I'm going to use this. Go up the stairs. Dun, 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 dun. Little mouse climbing on the, the wall there is a nice touch. There's a lot of little things in this game that... Really, if you think about it, uh, a lot of little details in this game, even though this game is uh, largely not as graphically impressive as Breath of Fire 2 was, uh, really there's a lot of little details in the graphics in this game that aren't in Breath of Fire 2. Although while it, it makes absolutely no sense for there to be a mouse right there, because this is supposed to be a tower, and there's supposed to be... I don't know, a ceiling right there. But, you know, it's there. That's kind of nice. Let's see. Do I want to use another marble? Uh, no, I think I'll let it go. Let's see. Go this way. I think I'm probably going to use another marble, because really, this game is the easiest game in the universe to do a low-level run on. I mean, like, seriously. Let's see. Do I want to go this way, or is it the other way? I don't remember. Arg. Oh, okay. Good, I picked correctly. Basically, I wanted to go the incorrect way so I can get the chest. And what the charms do, I think, and I forgot to use... I forgot to use the, uh, Marble 3, didn't I? Well then. Well, well, well then. Hey, another Dark Kiss. Let's see. Let's go ahead and use, uh, this. Really, if I need to do some grinding, which I'm really only... You need to grind a little bit at the beginning. After, like I said, after you get your fourth... About the time you get your fourth party member, well, it's a little before, you really don't need to do grinding anymore. Hmm, go upstairs. 
now I just gotta remember which side to go down. I think it's this one. And I think I chose wrong, actually. Yes, I totally chose wrong. Meaning, now I gotta go back up to the top of the tower. Damn. I did that the last time I played the game. Oh well. It's not too bit bad of a trip since I got those marbles. Although I'm gonna end up having to waste another marble to get up here. Erg. Wait a minute. I thought I had a... I guess it wore off? I wasn't paying attention, I, I guess. When did that wear off? Hum. In case you're wondering, yes, there are marble ones and twos. And what they do is you use them and they force you to get a critical hit. <clears throat> so they're actually pretty useful. Now all I gotta do is go down that right hole, which I guess it kind of makes sense. It's the right way is the right hole. Go down here. Let's see, almost to that guy. Just go down here and. Uh, get this treasure chest that's down here that's on the very bottom floor of the map ah, oh, life too pretty useful now what live what the life item does is as you can imagine life ones they just bring you back to life they bring you back with one HP while life twos restore all of your HP dark kisses You'll never be able to use this. Ouch, game. Like, seriously. They... That's like telling your child that you'll never be able to be president. More tea. Now, I keep seeing references that more tea is actually female. But regardless of whether you think she's female or not, think it's female or not, it's, uh... Regardless. Fort Nina. This guy is a lot stronger than the front gate guard. You know what? Just to be cheeky. And it would be funny if it worked. I don't think it does, though. Yeah, so you didn't think it would work. What you want to do here is you want to fort all three of the party members. And that's why. <laughs> Fort is a very, very useful spell in this game. Uh, I highly recommend you use a, a, turn, a couple of turns for Nina. In pretty much every boss battle, buffing at least four, at least forting herself, and any other low defense characters you have in your party. And then, if you have another free turn, then uh, use an attack up on the main character, because like we've already been through this, that's all he can do at this point in the game. You know what? I just realized I have a stone, don't I? That's everybody forded. So what we're gonna do here is let's see. ah yes.
Mortia seems all right. We're in a tower, right? Wouldn't like making the earth shake cause the tower to collapse? Maybe, possibly. I don't know. Just in case we end up in a get unlucky in a random battle, go ahead and heal him. <clears throat> and it closes behind us. Aw. Now you can actually go up those stairs and there's a uh, save point and a uh, healing spring. That's what I wanted to say. But uh, you actually have to open the gate there so that they can escape. These are the young women from Romero. That they were taught. You know, they mentioned uh, briefly that their young women were gone. Now those cures, what cures do, in case you were wondering, now if you look at them, it says that they restore some HP. They don't restore some HP. They restore all of your HP. But they're also incredibly expensive, and they're a good way to uh, basically stockpile money. In fact, I recommend that you basically just sell those if you need money. Keep them in your inventory in case you need to use them, but, uh... Uh-oh. The wizard! And, of course... He does a uh, uses us as an experiment for his Xeon gas. It is apparently a poisonous gas that only affects those of the Fey Clan, which is the actual Japanese name. What if? Oh, took all my AP. This is a scripted battle. Even if you manage to get your stuff back all the way up, you will event the, the battle will go over, everyone will collapse. So don't even bother. Just uh, auto battle and wait for the little scripted sequence to end. I'll distract the wizard. Please go get help. Now interestingly, of interesting note is there's actually a uh, manga of this, and I know I'm doing a, the long pause thing a lot. Once again, just auto battle. Can't You can't hurt him, can't kill him. And he'll just knock you unconscious. And then he'll get away. But of interesting note is that there's a manga of this, and the manga changes a lot of the uh, story around. I mean, it's a similar story, but a lot of the details are different. You fiend, you're going to use the princess as a test subject. And of course, he turns into a great bird and flies away. In the manga, the two soldiers stayed behind so Nina could escape. And then she met Ryu while running away, basically. Uh, when some people came to retrieve her for the wizard because they had gotten the remedy. Nina had gotten the remedy and gotten out. And what happens is uh, they go into uh, Nina. He walks upon Nina taking a bath. Some of the wizard's uh, minions come up and they fight and they take both of them to the tower and then at which point uh, Ryu defeats him. And then they end up taking the remedy back. And it goes from there. And our poor soldier number two just died. Alright. Basically, they're asking me to go with them because of the fact that of the Xeon gas. They can't get in to save Nina, so they need someone who is not a winged clan member to go down in there and save her. Now we have control of Ryu once again, and this is a good place to stop, isn't he? My name is Treble, this has been Breath of Fire, and I will see you next time.